Good afternoon ladies and gentlemen, my name is Pop. I'm making a video tutorial in Ubuntu Basics showing how you can merge together some EPUBs using Calibre. I have got Calibre open and I have two EPUBs in place here that I want to merge together into one. Quite often you will want to do this in order to create an anthology of short stories. Let's say you've got six short stories as separate EPUBs, you can merge them together and give them a new title called Anthology. In my case, I'm doing something slightly different. I've got a novel in line one right here, and it's quite lengthy. It's 5.6 megabytes, but I want to put a common blurb, 0.3 megabytes, and tack it on to the end. In other words, this blurb would be on the end of every, every similar such novel. It's going to be the dedication, other books by, afterward, legal disclaimer, those sorts of things. Well, the way you do this is in Calibre is to get yourself a plug-in. And that plugin is really easy to get. I'm first of all going to open up Preferences, and then I'm going to go down to Plugins, and then I'm going to get a new plugin, and I am going to tap right here where it says to get a new one. And then after I get to that one, I'm looking for the name of it. It's called EPUB Merge and then you just tap on it here and install it's installed close this now I'm going to apply and I'm going to close this and now I've got this new EPUB merge right here this is a plugin which allows you to take two or more items that you have selected and merge them together. Well, I've got my blurb and it goes on the end and I'm going to hold down my thumb on the control key and select this other one. I'm just going to be merging two things. It's 50-50 if it picked the right order. So let me go to EPUB merge and see if it accidentally got the right order. No, it got the wrong order, so I'm going to reorder the things. And let's see if I can get that moved. There, now it's in the right order. And I hit OK, and it will ask me a series of questions. It says, you sure you want to do this? And I'll say, all right. And Here's one thing that it does is it puts the word anthology on the end of it. That's all right with me. I'll, I'm just doing this as a demo. And it adds together the different authors. Well, I'm both of those same authors, but normally you would just have one. It also gets rid of the comments that's in book one and puts in this uh, boilerplate stuff that says anthology containing book one and this one, book two. You can change that around all you want. Then when you hit OK, it's pretty quick. It is going to get these things merged, and then we will be able to look at the new anthology. There is something that you can do to vary the table of contents. I want to demonstrate that. We will now open this new thing up. I'll tap on it, and the ebook reader will open it. The ebook reader will have both of them add together. And when I look at the table of contents, you see what it's done here. It has used the table of contents for the first book. And then it's separated. And here's the blurb. You can change the behavior of that all you want. You can do that by means of tweaking this thing. When you go over here to the EPUB merge configuration, and it asks you where do you want that table of contents do you want to flatten it or something like that and you can do all of this if you want to flatten the table of contents you'll just have one single table of contents there is another way to accomplish this without all the foo for all. of course you may have already thought of this yourself I'm going to diminish caliber let's open up an ODT Processor file in LibreOffice, and this is a let's say this is a novel, and here's the title of it. 
and then this is going to be the last chapter of it and this is the text in the last chapter and you want to tack your blurb on right here well one thing you can do is go to your blurb control A to select everything control C to copy everything that you've selected and then when you get here hit control V and it will paste it the other thing you can do that's simpler than that actually is to go here to insert and go to file and when you go to file you got to find the thing that you want to insert hit open and there it is that's the whole nine yards save it and then take this thing that you have saved over into caliber and then convert the ODT file into an EPUB my name is Pop and I've got a whole bunch of videos on YouTube called Ubuntu Basics and other topics and I thank you very very much I hope you enjoyed this